Welcome to the personal property tour for number 28 Cromarty Court in Glenrothes. Now this is a three bedroom terraced property for let and it is coming to the market very soon. So today I'm going to take you a look around inside. We're located in a really popular residential area in Glenrothes, close to amenities, close to public transport links and also the local schools. So let's take a look around inside. Okay guys, number 28. Now you could see the entrance door here on this side, UPVC door with the opaque glazed inlets um, at the side there, chrome finish handle. Let's head inside, which takes us into the entrance hallway. And you'll see we've got another entrance door at the rear of the property, which I'm gonna go out and have a wee look at at the moment, if there is a garage and things on the other side there. But the entrance hallway, you could see nice and bright, stairs leading up to the upper level. Got the electric box here, the laminate floorings, gas central heating, so radiators throughout. And again, the UPVC doors continue on the rear of the property and indeed the windows throughout the entire property. Lots of light getting through the opaque windows here that lead to the rear garden, which I'm going to give you a look at before we head upstairs. On this floor, though, there is the third bedroom. And this would be an ideal kids' room, study room. And it also has the window looking out to the rear. So you've got the rear garden and the garage there, which I'm going to show you guys in a minute. But it's a good additional room to have to the, um, the rest of the accommodation, which I'm going to show you, and it's on the upper level. But just before we do, I'm going to head outside and just give you guys a look. So down these stairs, quite a low maintenance rear garden here, which is all chipped stones and paved. You've got the garage here, which has an entrance gate from the car park. And you've also got the bins there, four bin system. Um, as usual, you'll usually find in Fife. Now the garage has got the entrance door on the side and the window and we'll just quickly have a look at this from the side so yeah ample parking out here but yeah the garage itself and then the property here where we've just come so we're going to head up to the upper level and look at the accommodation and it's surprisingly really spacious inside it's got a great living area and actually some nice views out over the green and the other side. So we'll head back in and have a look at the rest of the accommodation. But as you can see, as I say, the UPVC finish on the windows and doors is done quite well. And then you come in, this neutral decor, white and the grey and quite a plain canvas. That theme continues throughout the property. If we head up the stairs, you'll see We've got the carpeted stairs and hall in this light grey colour. And then the white walls continues throughout the hall. Now along the end here we have the lounge and the dining, kitchen, bathroom and two bedrooms. So we'll look at the bedrooms first. Good size double here. Now this window looks out over the rear garden. And you can see you've got ample space here for a king size bed. Continuing up the hallway, next again on the left, another really good sized double room. With that neutral decor in here. And a nice big window for light coming through. Across the hall, we have the shower room, so heated towel rail, that low level toilet with the cistern, wash hand basin and a vanity unit above, and then a really good size shower enclosure with the wet wall continuing right along, window there as well for light. And then back into the hallway, if we continue up and again on the right, we have the kitchen. It's actually quite a good sized kitchen. Now you do have room in here, you could put a small table with a couple of chairs, um, but there is a dining area through there 
as you can see through the glass um, partition as part of the lounge uh, diner. Plenty of cupboard space here, integrated oven and hob, washing machine there and space there where the, the fridge freezer is. Gas central heating as I said, this is a Worcester combi boiler and the sink and draining board looks right over that green which I said you get quite nice uh, views where I started the video. I'll show you that again from the lounge diner. But a very good size kitchen with everything you need. And then at the end of the hall we come into a really generous sized room with lots of natural light. You've got two windows on this side with lots of light coming through. You can see there's an extremely uh, substantial size sofa there which does not take over the room. Big radiator there for heat, entertainment system, so you could have TV and everything here. And then dining area as well. And as I said, where I started, out on the green there, you've got quite a nice outlook. And just at the other side of the house there, you've got the shops um, and other local amenities. We're close to the retail park here, so you've got, that's just down the road. And then again, obviously, schools and nurseries are all close by. And you've also got uh, Glenrothes High along the road as well. I'm sure you'll agree this is a great room. I love the light in here and the L shape just really works well as a lounge diner and a great family room. So guys, number 28 Cromarty Court in Glenrothes. It's a three bedroom terrace property Set out uh, in a bit of a unique way, as I say, you come in that lower level, you've got access from the back and into the back indeed, you've got that room downstairs, and then up on this top floor you have two bedrooms, the shower room, a good sized kitchen, and this brilliant L-shape lounge diner with great outlook and lots of natural light. New property for Let Guys, going to be very popular on the market, keep an eye out for that, if you want any further details, message me direct, or indeed speak to one of the lettings team on 01 treble 3 I'm Richard Cook guys, this is 5 Properties.